I've taken two low-cost measures. I've got four lovely bay windows in this house with radiators in front of them, but there's only a single layer of brick behind them. So uh, a neighbour, who's a handyman, um, used some padded foil and inserted it behind the radiators. Uh, he was able to do it in less than a day. It, it didn't cost very much, uh, and it's made a huge difference. Um, the other thing I did was, in, was put uh, LED bulbs in all my lights. They do cost more to start with, but my goodness me, they more than cover their own costs because they, they last for so much longer than ordinary bulbs. We uh, switch off our radiators at night and we also switch off any appliances we're using before we go to sleep. Washing clothes, uh, we hang them out on a dry day and we keep full loads at 30 degrees. We have thick, short curtains. They don't cover the radiator and that means the heat stays in. I'm going to show you some things that you can do which usually cost less than £10 and they will help you save energy. This is simple draft excluding strip which you can fit around windows and doors, stops the draft, keeps the heat in your house. This is a letterbox brush which you fit behind the letterbox and it again stops the drafts coming through your letterbox, keeps your hall warm. This is pipe wrap which you can wrap around your hot water pipes. This wonderful stuff is radiator foil. You fit it behind your radiator and it reflects the heat back into your room so that you're saving heat instead of wasting it. Our front door used to leak a lot of heat, as you can see from this thermal image where it's bright red. So we got a very thick curtain from the charity shop and now the hall's much less drafty. We've turned down our thermostat to 19 degrees and when I'm working at home and getting a bit chilly, I bring out my secret radiator. Eight pounds from a chemist.